Yeah, we're in Hydro City. And yes, it is, it is pronounced Hydro City. I don't care what anyone says. It, no. Like, in the um, Japanese manual, I believe it's pronounced uh, Hydro City in Japan, in like, uh, in Kana, I think is what the uh, lang language is uh, called. Um, or the, like, the symbols and all that. I think that's what it's called. Um, it's not pronounced, it's not, sp well, spelt out as hydros, or hydrosity, as people call it. And also, in the Sonic 3 and Nug in, bleh. Yeah, go like, go like that. Uh, whatever, bleh, things. <laughs> but, um, basically what I'm saying is that, in the, in Generations, when you get the Hydro City music track unlocked, it separates the Hydro and the City, so it's, it's spelled out as Hydro City. Uh, and that's my reasoning. Like, I'm, I don't, I really don't care the way you pronounce it, but that's the right way, gosh dang it. And it will stay that way. Uh, yeah, if you want to call it Hydrosity, more power to you, but... You're just wrong. I'm so. <laughs> yeah, I'm kidding. You can again. I really don't care, but the true, the true way to pronounce it is Hydro City, and that's the end of that. Uh, but yeah, this is actually one of my favorite water levels in the series because it's actually quite speedy for a water levels, for a water level. Shit, I can English. Um, but no, it's like you have a lot of paths you can take. It's not all just underwater. You do have a quite a few speed sections where you're just blazing, blazing down, blazing around really fast. And when you're even running, even running on water, I'm getting tired of, this, of the freezing, aren't you? I missed a chance to go to a special stage because of that thing. I I really hate this. Ugh. Sometimes it doesn't do it. Sometimes. Sometimes it's nice to me, other times it isn't. Alright, that was bad. Alright, basically... What you want to do is spin dash, and then... You get out of the way. Or you just jump out of the way, rather. And he's dead. But yeah, basically what I was saying is that... This game, this level, has you run on water and have, it has some speed sections. So, it's a lot more speedy than your average water level. And that's one problem I have with a lot of just water levels in games in general, is that it feels like a much slower paced version of the main game. And it just... I, I don't like the change in... Uh, uh, if only it didn't happen. If only it didn't keep freezing. But, yeah, but anyways, water levels... They they usually they're usually a lot more slow a lot a lot more slower paced than the other levels of the game, and I I just never liked that. I I never like how water levels slow things down from the rest of the game, and it just eh. like sometimes it does work in the game's favor. Like it's more peaceful and it gives you a calming environment. Like, I, I guess with Sonic, um, Mario 64 to an extent, but, uh, most of the time I just, no, I just don't enjoy underwater, water levels in games. Mainly the, fr mainly 3D games. Like, I get, I can enjoy a lot of 2D water levels, but 3D is where things start to, start to, start to become a problem for me. Yeah, because you have to go all go all around. It's like when you when it's a collector fun like Spyro, things become an issue because you have to go everywhere to find all the gems, and yeah, it's just not fun. Um, but yeah, the Hydro City is is an exception to this. Uh, instead of like being slow paced like with Labyrinth Zone, or I I guess you could say. Uh, Tidal Tempest as well, but to a lesser extent. Um, this is a much faster paced level than both of those. And it, it's just a nice change of pace. It doesn't 
slow down. It's not like an, a part of the game that slows down significantly. It's still, it slows you, you slow down underwater like you did, like you did before, but it doesn't feel as taxing anymore because you have so many speed sections now and it, you aren't always underwater. Like there are quite a few sections where you're platforming underwater, but it's not as painful, I guess. Not really, I never really found it painful in the other games, but it's definitely a lot more, it's a lot easier to go through, I want to say. But hey. They, I, I do think Labyrinth Zone has been over-exaggerated a lot, but I, I will say that it's, I real will say that I really don't like the change, the, ch the huge change of pace from like going super fast and then going underwater and your mobility is whoop, way down the drain. Like, I, I just don't like it. Anyways, going to the special stage again. Uh, a lot of the time I want to actually concentrate on these because I don't want to fail. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a lot easier to do uh, talk about these special stages in post because you are, you aren't doing them and talking at the same time. So yeah, it's kind of a problem doing it, talking and doing these. Speaking of which, I actually tried playing Sonic 2 again and tried to record the Super Sonic ending, but I didn't even get that. I, I didn't even get it. Like, I played the game again, and I still didn't get that freaking Super Sonic. Bleh. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I still didn't, didn't get Super Sonic, which kind of sucks. But hey, what are you going to do? Alright. So far, so good, eh? Eh. Yeah, I think these are the last ones. There we go. Woo! <clears throat> Couldn't get a perfect, unfortunately, but hey. Hey. Got four out of seven. Not bad. Yeah, I don't know where all of the um, uh, giant rings are, but I know where a decent amount of them are, so I am almost about done with this. Like, seriously, man. I don't know, I don't even know why it does that. Like, for GameCube games, it just doesn't like me. Like, <laughs> if I do Wii U, PS3, or... Uh, Okay, sorry about the little edit right there. I had to make some changes and I changed the preset I was working with and hopefully now we won't have to deal with stupid freezing anymore. Hopefully. I... Uh, something's probably going to happen, but I really hope that we can just get rid of that stupid freezing. Because that's more trouble than it's worth. And I really just want to get out of here, please. <laughs> right. There we go. Okay. Yeah. It's really, really annoying to play through a game and have to worry about all these times when the game or the recorder just freezes out on you. Like, you have no idea how hard it is to record and then just deal with that 24-7. Because I remember recording Mario, uh, Mario Sunshine for Seas, and it got really tedious after a while because it kept on freezing out. Gah. Dude, seriously, I just, yeah. Anyways, though, Hydro City. I really, this is definitely one of my favorite stages in the game. I... I don't really know if I have definite a definite favorite favorite stage, even for like 
even for just both, even for like Sonic 3 and Sonic and Knuckles, like separately. I don't even know if I'd be able to even do that, but I do really like Hydro City. It's, def it's definitely one of my top, top, top favorites. Like I, I, I put it in the stages I want, I wanted but weren't in Generations uh, GMD a year ago, I think. It was a while, it was a while ago, I, I can tell you that. But dang, it's been a while. I can't believe time goes by so fast, like, I still, I still can't believe that it's been five years since I started, over five years, since I st started a YouTube channel, like, I just, that, I, that concept, that just, that to me is just freaking crazy to think about, like, oh. <laughs> okay, okay, I think there's another special stage here. No! I refuse to give up, give up. I will get that. Ooh! And we ain't gonna get up. I can do this. And go a little bit higher so we can get more speed. And Ugh, come on. Her <laughs> tail's died. Too bad. So sad. Alright. That should be good. Alright. Okay, barely. Gosh. Alright. Alright, that motion blur is kind of hurting my eyes, I'm not gonna lie. I don't even know what, why it's doing that. Yeah. Sometimes it's there, sometimes it's not. That's really weird. I don't know why that is even there. But, um... What is it? The thing with this special stage is that... Just go through... Oh, crap. <laughs> go through all these areas. And when you see... When you get to, like, the four spheres around here, like that... Just go for one... Just go for two at, in a row, like... Just... The way, uh, okay, okay, okay. Just the way I'm doing it. Like, you go through there. Although well, that might, may have been a problem. All right, let me see here. That's how you do it. Pro strats. Oh, man. But yeah, you're just doing this. It's not too difficult, but... Make sure your thumb doesn't slip. Oh. Okay, okay. Uh. Um. I'm in trouble. Okay. Boss, I'm a boss. Yeah. Five out of seven. <sighs> okay. I want to actually be able to use Super Sonic this time around, cause it's well apparently not. Apparently the freezing is still here. Fabulous. I'm so done. I can't even remember what I was saying now. Dude. <laughs> oh no, it's the Knuckles. 
Yeah, Knuckles okay, occasionally appears just to ruin your day. Um, and it, it becomes the most apparent in in um, Carnival Night, I think it's called. Uh, where he, like, I think puts the lights off or something. And he makes it so you have to go through another whole section of the level, I believe. Or something like that. This is, a, this is the first mini game we did, I, I'm pretty sure, and I still really enjoy it. It's definitely one of one of my, if not one of my favorites, if not my absolute favorite. I just I just find it really fun to go to go through. Okay, that was really weird. <laughs> okay, so this boss is. Kind of interesting. Basically, what you want to do is, well, I guess you could have hit him then, but you want to stay cl steer clear of that and then jump on it so you can get like a hit on hit or two on him. But what you want to do that uh, after that is use his bombs so you can jump all the way up to him and get hit on. Whoa! Okay, <laughs> I ah <laughs> oh, man. Amazing stuff. <laughs> yeah. That doesn't us usually happen to me. If you do it right, you can make it so you can get a bunch of hits on him and event and maybe even as far as go like just one shotting him really, like staying on him. As long as you move the way he's moving, then you should be you should be fine. Yeah, I, I do like the bosses in this game because it's more than just hit the guy, hit the guy eight times and you're done. You actually have to slightly, slightly think. I like how tails are just moving there, but yeah, I'm actually gonna call it a session here because I, it just froze again. Are you are you kidding me? Yeah, like, exactly. I wanna actually fig figure out why it, it keeps on doing this freezing stuff before I go on because it. As you can probably tell, it's not doing me any good, and it's just, it's really hard to keep a, like, do a, do commentary with this thing happening, like, it just doesn't work. So, with that, I'll see you guys in Marble Garden and beyond for hopefully a, a freeze-free session, I guess. See you guys then.